Praise the Lord, beautiful people of God. This morning devotion is entitled The Key by Monica La Rosa. Hear the word of the Lord this morning. Take my yoke upon you and learn from me, for I am gentle and humble in heart, and you will find rest for your souls. Matthew 11, verse 29. In his classic book, The Human Condition, Tom and Keating shares this memorable tale. A teacher, having lost a key to his home, is on his hands and knees searching through the grass. When his disciples sees him searching, they join the hunt, but with no success. Finally, one of the more intelligent disciples asks, Master, have you any idea where you might have lost the key? The teacher replies, Of course, I lost it in the house. When they exclaim, then why are we looking for it out here? He answers, isn't it obvious? There is more light here. We have lost the key to intimacy with God, the experience of God's loving presence. Keaton concludes, without that experience, nothing else quite works. With it, almost everything works. How easy it is it to forget that even in life's ups and downs, God remains the key to our deepest longings. But when we are ready to stop looking in all the wrong places, God is there, ready to show us true rest. In Matthew 11, Jesus praises the Father for revealing his way, not to the wise and learned, but to the little children. Then he invites all of you who are weary and burdened to come to him for rest. Like little children, we can find true rest as we learn the ways of our teacher, who's gentle and humble in heart. God is there, eager to welcome us home. Our reflection for today. When are you tempted to look for satisfaction and joy in the wrong places? What helps you remember to find peace, rest, and satisfaction in God instead? Let us pray. Loving God, how easily am I drawn to seek satisfaction in whatever looks brightest. Help me to turn to you to find true rest. Amen. Once again, I'm going to encourage you to subscribe to this channel. Please pass this devotion to five new people and encourage them to subscribe as well. God bless you and you have a great day.